The Wood Whisperer is sponsored by Powermatic and Typebond. Today I'm going to give you a quick look at Festool's DF500 connector system. Now if you're a domino owner and you use knockdown hardware in your work, this is absolutely for you. The system works just like regular dominoes. You basically plunge the hole and you pop the hardware in. It works a lot like those uh, cam lock systems that we've all seen when you put together like IKEA furniture. In fact, I was thinking they might have a good slogan there, you know, just like IKEA, but a little bit better, <laughs> which is essentially what this is. So uh, this, by the way, is not an ad. Anytime I do an advertisement or sponsorship, it is always clearly labeled. This is something that I needed for my own project. So I am doing that executive desk project and this desk is huge. This is the center panel and one of the legs. So in order to keep my left and right pedestals separate so that I can move them separately, I need a way to get this center panel in there to join them and it has to be a non-permanent connection so that I can move it. So here is one of those. And back here, you can see I've got these little screws and that's what's holding the system together. So let me show you the hardware kit that I bought and then we'll look at how it goes together. This kit costs 375 bucks at the time of posting, but it is all inclusive. It pretty much has everything you need to make various joints, which they lay out up here. Uh, you've got a drill bit, which allows you to drill the hole in this little jig and just all these little components. And frankly, this is very intimidating. So all I really need for this particular project is one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these. So let's do an assembly. First, we need to do the layout, not only for the connectors, but additional regular dominoes that will help support the structure. The regular domino is eight by 40, so I'll go 20 millimeters into the leg and the panel. The connector requires me to plunge 15 millimeters into the leg and 28 millimeters into the panel. Now I just plunge according to the marks. The drill guide is then inserted into the 28 millimeter mortise and locked in place. Now I can drill the hole for the locking doohickey. Into the 15 millimeter leg hole, we can drop the post connector thing, flush it to the surface, and then screw in the post. Now we can add the threaded locking piece into the drilled hole as well as the plastic retainer. And finally, a set screw is inserted just enough so that it doesn't fall out. I'll glue my 40 millimeter dominoes in place on the panel side. We want those permanently attached to the panel, but not the leg. And now the moment of truth. The fit is pretty much perfect. Now let's see how well those little screws close up the joint. Gotta say, that's pretty good. Now, I absolutely realize that this is an incredibly deep niche here. We're talking about people who have dominoes who do knock down components, right? Uh, so if that doesn't interest you, I apologize, but I've gotten a number of questions about how this system works. And I'll tell you what, when I opened this thing up and I saw all those parts, kind of had no idea what to do. And Festool instructions can be pretty crappy. So it wasn't immediately obvious to me. So I figured I'd make a quick video showing how at least this one joint goes together and maybe it'll help somebody else. All right, thanks for watching everybody.